Good evening and welcome to Mortgage News. Westpac Group takes significant step to aid borrowers trapped in a mortgage prison. They are lowering the stress test on selected refinance application, providing much needed relief. Usually banks stress test borrowers to ensure that they can handle higher interest rates. From this Monday, Westpac and its subsidiaries, St George, Bank of Melbourne and Bank of South Australia will launch a streamlined refinance program. It allows selected refinanciers to be retested with a modified rate above the bank's floor rate as an exception. To be eligible, customers need a good payment record, credit score of over 650, and a lower monthly repayments. New home buyers face another blow as NAB, a major Australian bank, announces increased interest rate on home loans. The base variable rate will rise by 0.1%, reaching 5.99 for new buyers. Residential investor will also experience a 0.1% hike with a new rate of 6.34 for principal and interest repayments. This follows a series of interest rate hikes, including the recent increase in the cash rate to 3.85 by the Reserve Bank of Australia. Commonwealth Bank promptly raised its home loan variable interest rate by 0.25 per annum. Sydney housing market is on a strong upswing. According to CoreLogic, House prices have rebounded by 4.5% since February, and last week we saw a highest auction clearance rate since 2022 at 73%. Analysts now predict a potential 10% increase in house prices this year. Factors driving this surge include fewer missing out among buyers, low supply, and rising demand. And Connor believes the scarcity of property for the sale and rent has outweighed the impact of higher interest rates. However, Borrowing capacity constraint due to interest rate hikes are keeping prices in check. If Reserve Bank of Australia begins its rate cutting cycle, borrowing capacity will increase, potentially leading to skyrocketing house prices in Sydney. In New South Wales, the government plans to extend first home buyer stamp duty exemption while considering the removal of property tax option. The proposed legislation would increase the threshold for stamp duty exemption from 650 to 800 for the first home buyers. Additionally, concession would be available for property price between $800,000 and a million. The current land tax choice policy, allowing buyers to opt for an annual land tax instead of a stamp duty, will be abolished by July the 1st, affecting new buyers, but allowing existing participants to continue until the property is sold. A hot tip of the week, AMP Bank Essential Home Loan, designed for owner-occupy, 5.39%, interest rate with no application or ongoing fees. ANZ, 4,000 cashback when refinancing below 80% LVR or 2,000 cashback for refinancing above 80% LVR. Have a good evening.